If you're feeling tired, sluggish, and unmotivated to train, it may have nothing to do with sore muscles. Instead, it could be your central nervous system fatigue. Here's what that actually means. Your CNS is your brain and your spinal cord. It controls how hard your muscles can contract. After a heavy strength session or a high intensity sprint session, your motor cortex and neural pathways can get taxed, meaning that your brain struggles to send fast, strong signals to your muscles. That difference between your max force output and what you can put out today is CNS fatigue. And you'll feel it as slower bar speeds, poor coordination, or even a drop in vertical jump for days after your intense training session. Now, if your training plan is structured well, when you're more fatigued, you'll probably have a lower CNS session planned with an emphasis on mobility, stability work, and aerobic conditioning, for example. You'll get a parasympathetic response, helping you recover for your next hard training session. However, if your training isn't structured well, you could dig yourself further into a hole trying to sprint when you're fatigued or adding heavy maximal deadlifts. If you find that this is happening to you every week, consider first reducing your training volume to get out of the CNS fatigue hole, and then secondly, make sure that you're measuring your results to know if you're actually doing too much or too little. Finally, consider restructuring your training to alternate between high stress and low stress days to keep yourself fresh and motivated. Hope that helps. Follow for more training tips.